Hey guys, Jacob here. This is going to be a quick video on how I got the BTSU Exotic Gloves. Originally, I was not going to make this video due to the fact there's so many videos already out there on how to get these gloves. Uh, but I decided to make it just to show some of you guys that they do drop on Camp White Oak. This was the first try on the mission. I'm not saying they drop 100% guaranteed. Um, but for some reason for me, they decided to drop because I guess RNG really wanted to give them to me because I have crap luck with exotic drops in general. And it took me months just to get the Sweet Dream Shotgun, which for some reason I guess finally decided to drop on a mission I didn't even expect to get it from. Um, but this is just the footage now at the end of Camp White Oak. You guys will actually see the boss at the very end. After you kill a few PCs, he'll be out there in the field um, or in the gully area, whatever we call it. And once you kill him, he will drop gear. And he does have a chance to drop the BTSU gloves. And just remember, this is my first try on the mission. Um, this was not on challenging or heroic. This was first try, um, and I, for some reason, I guess that the game decided to want to give them to me because I did not think you could get them from story mode. But you guys will see here that you can, um, at least I, I did on the first try. And I know some people who've been doing this mission over and over and over get these, and some people have done this mission 20 to 30 times and still haven't gotten them. I know people who've done this mission, you know, two to three times and gotten two pairs of them. So I guess. Uh, depending on how your luck is, um, you may get these first try, or it might take you 20 to 30 times to get these. You have to see, here's the boss right here at the very end, and did manage to kill him, and boom, those are the gloves right there, and I did get those from the first boss drop. But um, that's about it, guys. Thank you all for watching. If you guys are new, make sure you guys subscribe to the channel for more Division 2 content and Borderlands 3 content that's going to be later on in the future. Thank you guys all for watching. As always, I'll catch you guys in the next one. had the training. We fought to protect the weak. But training doesn't prepare you to hunt someone you used to call brother. He has left us no other choice. If we don't stop him, there will be nothing left to save.